rush hour. That's why there's so many people on the train right now. It's really packed, but you know, it's better than being in a car. take trains and yes. then cars. Yeah. In Paris, we don't uh, have the need to use a, a car because we can use bike and we can use the bus or the train or just walk. Uh, I don't have a car. <laughs> Je n'ai pas de voiture. Bibliothèque François Mitterrand. takes two hours but the whole thing for me from one home to the other is seven hours so this one is 18 so the thing is I know it's much more but I'm relaxed I, I take trains most times uh, two three times a week to have uh, access to trains. You can go to places like Ramsgate or up to London and our children live in London so, so it's good to have that facility on hand and it's only a couple of minutes to walk to the station. I love driving, absolutely I think driving is great and it's my quiet social space, I don't even have a hands-free mobile telephone set. But if I'm going from A to B for a meeting or to give a presentation or whatever it is, I actually quite prefer to take the train because it's useful time and you can relax, you can walk up and down the carriage, you can go and get yourself a cup of coffee, all of those things that you can't do in the car and, and also you can depend on it. There's not going to be, but well, you trust, there's not going to be the uncertainty of delays of roadworks or a car accident or a jam. You can time it better. And if it is late, hey, it's not your fault. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Which is also kind of good. <laughs> there's like a huge party behind me. They're drinking champagne and eating fresh fruits. And it just seems like a really good time. So this trip from Frankfurt to Paris is going to take us 3 hours and 49 minutes. And we'll be covering a distance of 292 miles. And if we were in the US, that would be comparable to a trip from Richmond, Virginia to New York City. And we looked this up earlier on the Amtrak website. And it's supposed to take 6 hours and 32 minutes, which is it's a significant difference from the trip that we're taking today. I can imagine being able to go that fast in the US. 